it's very important to exercise on a daily basis you you need to move we are so overrun with work and stress and anxiety people sit behind the desk all day we always tell people sitting is the new smoking it's bad for you so exercise is very important to counteract all of that that you're doing in the same breath for a healthy heart you have to exercise I think um, many years ago they would have told people with heart conditions stop exercising don't do anything bed rest and that's the complete opposite the heart is a muscle and you want to exercise it and it will keep you healthy for longer very important warm up properly so you want to do a nice long run nothing too intense to start off with but you can increase the intensity as you go anything like star jumps just to get your heart rate going a little bit and involving all the joints that you're going to use so make sure your shoulders are warmed up all the joints your knees your ankles and then you can do a bit of light stretching but i always encourage people to stretch after training so it'll help it, it's part of your cool down so it'll help bring your heart rate down again after your training long stretches so holding a stretch for at least 30 seconds is what's beneficial and lots of foam rolling so that's one thing that people have now started doing more of is foam rolling and you'll see all the rugby players doing that as well it is awesome for helping with muscle tension any sort of any muscle group you can you can foam roll or use a smaller device doing the same kind of thing of fascial relief so a few simple stretches that you can do you can do it at the gym or at home it doesn't really matter um, first we'll start with a foam roller so this thing is gold great tool to have you can have it in your suitcase or in your gym bag and it's an amazing way to just keep your hips mobile um, your low back mobile and it's very nice for stretching your muscles and releasing them I'm gonna start with my quads so very big muscle group very important to always stretch or mobilize the quads put it by my thighs onto my elbows and I'm just gonna roll backwards and forwards rolling over my quads and I don't go over the joints so you want to stop right before the knee don't go over the knee and then roll back up again to the hips but not over the hip joint and you can do that for a minute then what you can do more with this is your hips so I can go ahead and I sit on my roller arms behind you so I'm gonna roll up my right hip first so I put my right leg up and I just lean slightly to my right and then I go backwards and forwards over that glute, over the hip, and you'll feel where all the tight spots are. Just backwards and forwards for a minute. Then if you do the left side, same thing. Left leg up, slightly to the left, and I go backwards and forwards over my left hip. Another important stretch that you can do for lower back pain is the hip flexor. So you're gonna go down into a lunge position, and then you wanna just push your hips forward and you'll feel the stretch in your hip flexor and then just to make it stretch a bit more you're going to twist away from that area and then I can feel it stretching into my hip flexor now the biggest thing is to make sure that you don't overarch your back which is a mistake people quite often make then I can't feel my hip flexor stretching at all so make sure you've got a nice neutral pelvis keep that tight push your hip forward stretch away from it and hold it for 30 seconds. A very nice hamstring stretch that I like to do with people, it includes the calves and the hamstrings. I use a plank for my patients, but at home I tell them they can use the yellow pages, it doesn't really matter. You're gonna put both your feet on, feet close together, just your toes must go on. From there, nice and slowly, I'm gonna go down, keeping my legs straight, my knees don't bend, coming back up, and you can do that 20 times nice and slowly even if you don't go down as fast some people only get to here that's fine the more you do it the better it will get so down and back up 